How does the second mortgage become an unsecured debt? My name is Laura Clover. I'm an attorney practicing here in Southern California. And let me tell you how it is done. You file a special petition under Chapter 13 uh, of the Bankruptcy Code. And that special petition is called a lien avoidance or lien stripping petition. And what you do is that uh, you must submit an appraisal uh, establishing what the present market value of your property is. And if you establish that uh, there is not enough equity to to cover the first mortgage, much less the second mortgage, then your second mortgage becomes an unsecured debt. One of the other prerequisites is that it must be your primary residence. You cannot do it with investment properties. It must be your primary residence. Now, it is a complicated process. Uh, the court has to make the finding that this, there's not enough equity in your home and that it becomes an unsecured debt. Once uh, you have filed the order from the bankruptcy court making a finding that it is an unsecured debt, then uh, it becomes uh, treated like many other unsecured debts. It is dischargeable. And I will define what the term dischargeable or discharge means in, an, in another um, video. At this point, I would like to um, have you call me to make sure that we can help you save your home if you're facing those difficulties. Uh, pick up the phone, call me at 562-494-2828. And remember that uh, are, we're in the business of uh, assisting consumers save their homes and eliminate their debt. Thank you for taking the time to look at this video and I'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.